Okay guys, what we got today is uh, actually I'm gonna do a cast iron New Year's strip maple uh, seasoning steak uh, with uh, baby potatoes, tomatoes, and zucchini. The first thing we do is actually lighting up the fire with natural big wax. My technique is actually having three bricks in the middle so I could condense the fire so I could put on top so I could put the cast iron on top so I could have the heat concentrated in the middle. So once it's the light up just cover that with charcoal so you can light up your fire. While we're lighting up the fire we can actually start seasoning our New Year's strip. Get your maple seasoning which contains black pepper, sea salt, maple sugar, and frosted garlic. Season well, both sides. By actually pushing the seasoning to the meat. So it will well be seasoned inside. Just like that. Seasonal angles. Season all that fat because you wanna get you wanna have that fat well cooked, which is so good when it's actually melting with the butter, which is super crazy. If you want to light up the fire faster, just blow air to the middle of the heat. Once the fire is light up, you take your cast iron and put it on top. You can see how hot it is. You blow a little bit and you see the fire coming out. It's very hot. You let the pan to get hot before put any olive oil in it. Just add a little bit of olive oil and let it be hot before putting the steak in the pan. Once the, hat, the pan is hot, just let your steak on top of the pan. Just like that. Let it cook for about three minutes of each side before basting. Just hear that how it's sizzling there with the, with the charcoal uh, cooking slowly. Believe me, cooking with charcoal is, is just make the food so delicious. Look at how look these things are becoming, you know, cooking it with charcoal slowly. Once you have a sear on the side, just add your thyme and your garlic in the middle so you can give that wonderful taste to your steak. After you have the garlic, you actually have the butter all around so you can finish the steak basting it with butter. Water and paste. Paste it on top. Please melt it. Just actually baste the steak for about three minutes, so you can actually get the juices go back to the steak. But that's what you want. You want to have a juicy steak when it's done. Because otherwise, if you don't baste it, then it's gonna be dry. Laying your steak sideways, resting on the side of the pan, will allow the fat to become crispy. So, while the steak is cooking, so we're gonna cut the zucchini. So we could have it with the semi, boiled potatoes, and tomatoes. Take your steak off the cast iron and let it rest for at least five minutes before cutting it. While the steak is resting, then add a little bit more butter to these juices from the steak 
to actually cook the zucchini in these juices. This is gonna be so delicious when you add the zucchini, the tomatoes, and the potatoes here. First, cook the zucchini, and then add the potatoes. And at last, you will add the tomatoes. Since the zucchini already cooked on one side, just flip it to the other side so you can finish it cooking both sides. While they're cooking on the side, add the tomato, aside with the butter, and let it cook together with the zucchini. Once you add the potato and mix it well with the zucchini and the tomato, add a little bit of salt and pepper to your taste. Potatoes are done with the zucchini and the tomato. Take it off the cast iron and put it in a regular plate. Just look how delicious those zucchinis, potatoes, and tomatoes look like. It is like before you eating them, it is like they lift, it is like they're melting in your mouth. Just, got, just take diagonals, it could be easy, so it could be more easy to eat this way. Let's just cut the diagonal, put it on the plate. Cut the potatoes, put the zucchini, and the tomatoes. Put a little bit of that goodness on top of, this, of the steak. Just like that. And serve it mm -hmm. to your loved ones. They will love this. If you like to see more of these delicious recipes, just subscribe to our channel and enjoy. Mm -hmm.